Welcome to the last episode on my quest to see the fourth and sixth largest cave in the world. Make sure you check out the last two episodes where we got to swim in a flooded cave system. Ab sailed 100 meters into a massive canyon. I said I wasn't scared. And now looking down there, I'm getting kind of nervous. And even had lunch with a million dollar view. In today's episode, we continue further into the depths of the jungle with the mission of laying our eyes on two of the largest cave systems on the entire planet. Buckle in for an episode full of adrenaline and a once in a lifetime opportunity. Good morning, guys. And welcome to day three. Cheers. Cheers. Woo. Before heading out to some of the world's biggest caves, we had one last opportunity to abseil on this protruding boulder right inside our campsite. And me, being the adrenaline junkie that I am, you know I had to partake. They've been posing him for so, so long now. And this really, really hurts your back. <laughs> no, not okay yet. Five minutes. Five minutes like that, okay? All right, guys, time to head out to the caves. So we are at the second entrance of Tiger Cave and as you guys can see we gotta crawl through that really small hole right there. So time to switch to the GoPro. It's crazy guys. And what's mental about this is this connects to um, the other cave that we were at the first day. So Tiger Cave has a total of four different entrances to get into it. It's like a crazy system of passageways. So you guys can see, look how big this cave opened up into. Absolutely huge. And where we're gonna be going swimming is, there's a passageway just right ahead of me here. Let me show you guys. But we're gonna be swimming down this like, hallway of a cave I guess with a river running through it it's gonna be super super cool but super super cold <laughs> oh. oh my god we're gonna slowly get ourselves wet here this is absolutely incredible all warm again guys we are now heading to the fourth entrance of Tiger Cave and we're gonna be stopping there to have some lunch Oh, so glad to be warm again. We have made it to the fourth entrance of Tiger Cave and this one is the biggest one out of all the entrances to Tiger Cave and yet again I have just been spoiled with these craziest craziest views uh, come again. You eat rice with this? Yes. Yeah, yeah, okay. You want? Yeah, please. See? Mommy's yeah, thank you, you mommy. <laughs> uh, yeah, one piece, just one. Only one? Yeah, only one. Thank okay. you. Guys, and we are off now to Hangover Cave and then Pygmy Cave right after that. So Hangover Cave is pretty close, 10 minutes away. Welcome to Hangover Cave. Hangover Cave, that is the number six. Oh really, number and six. Me is the number four. Oh really? Cave so most of the biggest caves in the world in, in Fong, yeah. Uh -huh. That's so cool. So actually, at the moment, like we have six biggest caves in the world, but in Fong, we already have four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the first, the third, the fourth, and the sixth. Wow, you guys are very lucky. So many good tours here then. Basically, a couple explorers got really lit inside this cave, so now they're calling it Hangover Cave. The cave is about an hour and a half to two hours to Pygmy Cave because it connects and then we need to abseil into the next camping section where we're going to be hanging out for the rest of the night here. So, let's go in! We got a man down! Oh no, we got mud all over him! Look at all that mud! Oh no! Look at that cave, man! 
Oh, oh no. The GoPro too. GoPro. Okay. I just told them like uh, this is the biggest room of the hangover cave. Yeah. So from the left to the right, that around 125 meters. Mm -hmm. So from the bottom of this hole to the ceiling, around 80 meters. Can you show me the hole? You cannot see you that. You can't even see that down there. That's crazy. Yeah. Wow. <clears throat> it's like a canyon inside of a cave. Guys, look at all of these dog types here. Absolutely amazing. So guys, we finally, finally made it and I cannot put into words what this view looks like but it's way too dark to show you guys around so I'm gonna show you guys in the morning what our campsite looks like so fast forward till tomorrow good morning guys check out this incredible view right behind me here Woo. this is where I slept last night how crazy is that just to be woken up by the sounds of the bats, the sounds of the nature all around us, the river down below there. It was just so, 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 so serene. This is like a traveler's dream to be able to wake up somewhere just so beautiful. Let me show you guys around the campsite. Let me show you guys where we stayed last night. So right behind me, you guys can see this massive, massive cave, or part of it at least, let me show you. So you guys can see, look how big and grand this cave is here. Absolutely mesmerizing. And it goes for so, so, so long down there. So you guys remember yesterday where we had to do that um, cliff walk into this cave here where we had to detach our harnesses and hook them onto this rope and walk along the cliff. So we started all the way from out there, made our way into this beautiful campsite and just to be greeted with such a vast, vast piece of art. Incredible, truly, truly incredible. All had our tents set up right at the opening of this cave right here. And I think I had the best view. So this morning I woke up and it was freezing, freezing cold. All I needed to do is open that hatch and I had the most stunning view of this cave right from my tent. Let me show you guys. How truly incredible is this? Waking up to this view, Literally a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and I'm so happy I got the chance to do this. Good morning, boss. Hey, how are you? I'm good. I'm coming for a fist pound. This view, Beautiful. incredible, man. Incredible. I had the best view from my tent, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I woke up too cold. I just unzipped, and it was perfect. So many bats, too. Not bats. Swallow. Wallows? Swallow. Swallow. What's a swallow? S-W-A-L-L-O-W. Is that a type of bird? A bird. Oh shit. I thought they were bats. No, no, he's a bird. So, you guys can see, I'm not sure if you're able to pick up this. Okay, let me zoom in, see if we can pick up these swallows. Also want to give a huge shout out to one of the best guides I've ever had. Trung Messi. Last name Messi because he's really good at soccer, right? Yes, hi guys, I'm Messi. <laughs> so if you guys go on the con class, make sure you ask for Trung because he's been an amazing, amazing guy. Super knowledgeable and he's handsome and funny. So perfect combo. <laughs> Woo! All done. Yeah. <sighs> We're all done. Hello everyone. Good job. Oh yeah. Woo! Yeah. 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 High five. High five. Yeah. Oh, what's wrong with yeah. I don't know. Something oh. All right guys, and there you have it. If you guys enjoyed that video, please throw a like on it, comment and subscribe as it would really help me out on this channel. And if you are interested in this hike, the link will be in the description below. The company is called Jungle Boss. They do an incredible, incredible job 
on taking you through this tour safely and enjoyably. So make sure you guys check them out. And if you guys enjoyed the music and you want copyright music for your own videos where you can monetize it without getting hit with any copyright strikes, link is in the description below. If you sign up using that link, you'll get your first two months off. But that is how I find all my music to fill the story of my videos. And guys, I will see you guys in the next video.